Welcome to our presentation on electrical hazards. Because electrical equipment is so common in the workplace, we are frequently exposed to electrical hazards. The tool that makes a job easy and efficient may one day be the cause of a tragic accident. Common sense safety practices include the regular testing and tagging of electrical equipment in line with legislative requirements. All power tools and equipment are to be maintained as per manufacturer's recommendations and only used for the intended purpose the tools or equipment were designed or intended for. Before you start work conduct a risk assessment of the work area and environment. Remove all damaged electrical equipment from use, tagging them out of service. Use a ground fault circuit interrupter or GFCI, residual current device or RCD, and plug it into the main power source. The GFCI or RCD will trip if any dangerous electrical conditions are detected. Ensure power leads don't become trip hazards. Ensure walkways are kept clear at all time. Electrical leads must not lay across vehicle access ways or used in wet conditions or on moist surfaces. If an electrical hazard is identified, do not touch it. Cordon off the area and report the hazard immediately. If you have any concerns or questions, ask your supervisor.